everybody. All right, so I just want to do a quick little video. I managed to catch this big moth in my garage, and I just figured, hey, it looks like a good snack, looks like a good lunch, dinner, all of the above. I think I'm gonna go ahead and give him to one of my fish. I'm not sure what fish I'm gonna give him to. But let's go ahead and take a look and decide on which fish to give it to. All right, guys, so we got three choices that we can choose. We got this tank, this tank, and then of course that tank right there. Let's go ahead and get a close up of these tanks. So the first one I'm gonna look at are the green spotted puffers. These guys are the little mini piranhas of the puffer fish world. These guys will absolutely tear apart that butterfly. They usually will eat anything. Butterfly might scare them off a little bit because it is kind of big and frightening. So they do get scared sometimes, but for the most part, they will go after just about anything. Or, I might feed it to this guy right here. This is a new puffer that I just got. This is a spiny box puffer fish. And I do apologize for the crappy lighting, guys. This tank, I don't know what it is, it's just that it has good lighting. It just doesn't get the fish to look good at all. I don't know why. So we could feed it to him. Pretty sure he'll do some damage to that thing. And then of course we got the giant prawn shrimp, which I know he will do major damage to that butterfly. So those are the three choices. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm gonna try the green spotted puffers. And if that doesn't work, we will try the giant spiky puffer. And then uh, if he eats it, then there will be no food for you, Mr. Prawn Shrimp. But if everything fails, the giant prawn shrimp will be our last resort. So let's go ahead and do this. All right, guys, so here is our moth, our butterfly, whatever you wanna call it. If anybody knows what kind of moth that is, please let me know. Leave a comment down below and tell me what kind of moth or butterfly this is. We finally got the moth. Let's go ahead and feed it to the green spotted puffer fish first. See what they do. something new today. Puffer fish, they love bugs. <laughs> I 
What do you guys think of the new puffer fish? You guys think I made a good addition? I think so. Just look at him eat that thing. Let's see if I can get a better view. Come on, buddy. Finish up. Is that enough? You done? Alright, I think he's calling it quits. I don't think they like the wings. Alright guys, all that's left is the head and the wing. We're gonna go ahead and give it to the prawn shrimp. Look at this little bluegill. Oh, prawn shrimp knows there's food. Oh, and he goes for the kill. And that's the best thing about prawn shrimps is they will eat everything. Whatever's left over that the other fish don't want to eat, prawn shrimp will take care of it for you. Look at this guy. More wings. Eat up. Eat up. Get it, buddy. Get it. There you go. Don't let nothing go to waste. <laughs> I love my fish guys, I really do. This is the best part about keeping shrimp and puffer fish and just aquariums in general is the feeding. Feeding fish is one of the best things and coolest things to watch in the world. I enjoy it more than, more than anything in the world. So I know this video is kind of short guys. Hopefully I can come out with uh, some longer videos here in the next few days. But I just thought this would be a really cool video to show you guys. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, and peace out.